frog frog can live both on land and on marine water no this is false most common species of frog found in india is rana tigrina rana tigrina is also called bull frog frogs are homeotherms no false frog show camouflage yes true what is camouflage camouflage is the ability to change the color to hide themselves from the enemies Cam uh, camouflage a uh, protective coloration is an example of mimicry summer sleep is called estivation winter sleep is called hibernation morphology the skin of the frog is smooth and slippery due to the presence of mucus the color of dorsal side skin is olive green the color of ventral side skin is uniformly pale yellow nostrils are absent in frogs no this is false frogs never drink water true how do frogs fulfill their water requirements absorbed it through the skin identify the parts of frog shown in diagram 1 so here in diagram 1 a is the trunk b is head c is the eye d is forelimb e is the hind limb frog body is divisible into head and trunk eyes of frog are covered with a dashed membrane which protect it from water with a nictitating membrane a membrane is dashed to receive sound signals a membrane is tympanum hind limbs end in four or five digits they end in five digits four limbs end in four digits four limbs are more muscular than hind limbs no false feet have webbed digits that help in that help in swimming frogs are able to exhibit sexual dimorphism yes true copulatory pads are present in females no false male frogs are distinguished from female by the presence of sound producing vocal cords and copulatory pad copulatory pad is present on the dash digit of the fore or hind limb it is present on the first digit of the fore limb anatomy digestive system anatomy digestive system frogs are herbivores omnivores or carnivores the frogs are carnivores the mouth opens into the dash that leads to esophagus through dash the mouth opens into the buccal cavity that leads to esophagus through the pharynx the mouth opens sorry identify the internal organs of the frog shown in diagram 2 so here in diagram 2 a is the esophagus b liver c is stomach d is intestine e is rectum f is cloacal aperture g is cloaca h is urinary bladder i is ureter j is kidney k is fat bodies l is lung m is gall bladder n is heart tell the root of frog food in frog so mouth buccal cavity pharynx esophagus stomach intestine rectum then cloaca liver secretes bile that is stored in gall bladder food is captured by the unilobed or bilobed dash so food is captured by the bilobed tongue partially digested food passes from stomach to duodenum is called chyme final digestion takes place in intestine respiratory system in water frog respire by skin in land frog respire by buccal cavity skin and lungs respiration through skin is called cutaneous respiration in water dissolved oxygen in the water is exchanged to the skin by diffusion yes true lungs of frog are of dash color are of pink color lungs of frog are present in thorax yes true during estivation and hibernation gaseous exchange takes place through skin through the nostrils air first enters in the pharynx and then into the lungs and frog no this is fall air first enters into the buccal cavity vascular system frogs have a lymphatic system yes true lymphatic system consists of lymph lymph channels and lymph nodes heart is covered by a membrane called pericardium a triangular structure called dash joins the left or right atrium a triangular structure called the sinus venosus joins the right atrium the ventricle opens into dash on the ventral or dorsal side of the heart the ventricle opens into the conus arterios on the ventral side of the heart renal portal system is present in frog no sorry yes true hepatic portal system is also present in frog yes true rbcs of frog are nucleated yes true rbcs have hemoglobin yes true excretory system excretory system consists of pair of kidneys ureters cloaca and urinary bladder kidneys are dash colored and dash shaped so they are dark red colored and bean shaped the ureters act as urinary genital ducts in all frogs no this is false in female the genital and urinary ducts are different kidneys are situated little anteriorly in the body cavity 
snow falls little posteriorly not anteriorly urinary bladder is thick walled no falls this is it is thin walled they excrete urea uric acid or ammonia they excrete urea nervous and nerve sensory system how many cranial nerves are present in frog so 20 cranial nerves are present in a frog brain is enclosed in a bony structure called dash or dash called brain box or cranium brain is divided into brain is divided into forebrain midbrain and hindbrain nervous system is divided into central peripheral and autonomic forebrain includes olfactory lobes paired cerebral hemisphere and unpaired diencephalon dash is characterized by a pair of optic lobes midbrain hindbrain consists of cerebellum and medulla oblongata pineal body is present in frog yes true the medulla oblongata passes out through the dash and continues into the spinal cord passes through the foramen magnum which two senses in frogs are well organized structures eyes and internal ears frog have simple or compound eyes so they have simple eyes external ear is absent in frog yes true the ear in frog doesn't help in balancing no this is false reproductive system male reproductive organs consist of a pair of dash colored and dash shaped testes so it is yellowish colored ovoid shaped testes these are adhered to the upper or lower part of the kidney so they are adhered to the upper part of the kidney by a single or double by a double fold of peritoneum this double fold of peritoneum is called mesorchium ways of differentiate are dash to dash and number that arise from dash so they are 10 to 12 in number that arise from testes they enter the kidney and open into bidder's canal describe the path of sperm from testes to cloaca testes ways of differentiate then kidney bidder's canal urogen urogenital tract then cloaca cloaca is used to pass fecal matter urine and sperm identify the path of the male reproductive system of frog shown in diagram 3 so here in diagram 3 a is the vas afferentia b is testis c is adrenal gland d is rectum e is urinary bladder f is clopal aperture g is cloaca h is urinogenital duct i is kidney and j is fat bodies identify the parts of female reproductive system of frog shown in diagram 4 so here in diagram 4 a is the oviduct b is the oviduct c is ova b is the ureter e is cloaca f is cloacal aperture and g is urinary bladder ovaries have functional connection with kidneys no false a mature female can lay dash to dash ova at a time can lay 2500 to 3000 ova at a time fertilization is internal or external it is external development in frog is indirect Yes this is true larval stage of frog is tadpole tadpole undergo dash to form adult metamorphosis dash hormone is necessary for metamorphosis to occur thyroxin frogs are beneficial for mankind because they eat insects and protect the crop frog disturb the ecological balance no false in some countries the muscular legs of frogs are used as dash by man as food by man thank you